What is up everyone, it's Castle Gaming here and welcome back. So guys, the new update patch 222 has just came out. It actually came out overnight and I am on it now. Um, I've jumped into single player and before any of you moan in the comments below, I have been enabling some cheats and I have force tamed this thing because I don't have time to actually run around look for it in survival and do all that and I don't have an actual server to play on and actually do this. So... I'm going to show you the stats of this when I tamed it, because it is absolutely ridiculous. It, this right now, it is level 9, and... Oh, that's my inventory. Um, it is level 9, and look at its stats. Look at its health at level 9. 115k. Now, per level, it only goes up by 300, which is fair, considering uh, even at level 1, it has over 100k health. Um, regarding damage, it is really, really bad, as you can see down here, it's only 75%, and that doesn't really upgrade by much at all. So I don't really know what it skills in, there doesn't, doesn't seem to be a main factor. So if you're going to be using this as a battle mount, you're going to have to do a hell of a lot of skilling if you want to get your damage up to a decent level, and in my opinion, it's kind of pointless going for health. As it starts off at 100k and you don't really need more than that. It's a bit stupid. Um, I want to show you the raw compared to the Rex because... Just, yeah. Do you, do you see that? Just look how bad it is. For such a big beast like this, it has such a pathetic raw. It, I think that really does need working on. Like, if I jump onto the Rex here, you can see the difference. Oh, not you. Here's the Rex's raw. The Rex just sounds so much more fierce than this thing here. Oh yeah, look at this. So the stamina on this one's only 400, and as far as I'm aware, it actually does quite a lot of damage. Uh, in my opinion, I think it's too big. I don't really like the size. It kind of looks a bit stupid, but I'm sure you will have different opinions on it. If you look at the top right, as I look into the sky, next to the health bar for the dino, you can see, I don't really know what that picture is. It literally looks like a picture of a piece of meat or something. But I did hear on the forums, the Reddit forums, and on other videos that this thing is really bad at regening. Well, it's something to do with its health that makes it not that good. Um, I'm going to spawn a bunch of things in for you. Uh, now, because uh, the hit, the uh, area of attack on this thing is so large, it is ridiculous. So I'm going to go ahead and spawn in loads of trikes by here and show you how much damage you can do against a uh, huge bunch of dinos. All right, guys. So I've went in and spawned a whole load of trikes. I just want to show you how many it can kill in its attack radius. Just look at that. Look how many of those died right there one shots them all and i know they are trikes and you're probably thinking that it's not really a fair test but um i'll probably spawn in some rexes now my only fear is that the rexes might be able to take this thing out as i'm spawning them in uh, i'm not that good at the cheat command so i don't really know how to pause them and make them so they don't do anything but i'm just going to keep skilling damage on this thing it doesn't go that well look at what the hell <laughs> all this meat already that is just brilliant um, I'll spawn in a bunch of Rexes now and see what it can really do against some stronger opponents. <laughs> Alright guys, so I've spawned myself in a whole load of Rexes, <laughs> which are already dead. Uh, they did come in loads of different levels, most of them were low levels, but you just saw that massacre there. They just all got wiped out. Um, this thing seems quite op. Uh, yeah, this thing seems quite powerful. Uh, it does destroy stone walls, um, stone structures and stuff. I don't really, I haven't really tested that, so I'm going to go and test that now. Okay guys, so it turns out I actually can't get any uh, stone structures down. The main reason is, uh, if I do place them, it will be in my tribe, and the only way to actually break them would be to have an AI Giganotosaurus or Giganotosaurus, I don't know how you pronounce it, there's a lot of different ways, but apparently it's pronounced Giganotosaurus or something like that, but I can't actually spawn in any of the stone structures as it'll be connected to my tribe and I won't be able to destroy my own things. What I am going to do, I'm going to spawn in another one of these, a Giganotosaurus, 
and I'm going to see how well they do against each other. See who is victorious, and it's not working. And see what damage the other one can do to me. I've actually forgot the code. I just put it in. Alright guys, I've spawned another one in, which is got stuck inside of me, which is kind of annoying. Um, I want to see how much damage it does to us. Well, it is actually doing a, a pretty large amount of damage. Uh, I don't know the... Oh, if you look up at the top right, you can see that there's a little red picture of Jaws of a countdown timer. I don't know what that is, but there's some sort of... I actually don't know. I think this thing bleeds out. So once it gets bit, it has a lot slower regen, bleeds out, and makes it easier to kill. Now, as you can see, I'm actually getting wrecked by this thing here. I don't even know what level it is, but it's wrecking me. Whoa. This isn't looking good. I'm about to lose the... Gigan yeah, there we go. Level 18 Giganosaur Giganotosaurus was killed by a level 9 female one. So, I have no idea how this works. I'm going to get on the Rex, see if the Rex is any better, which it probably is. Oh, no. The Rex got one-shotted. Run! Run to the Mosasaur! But, the AI ones do seem to be pretty overpowered. I'm going to get in my Mosasaur quickly and see if I can get out of here. Ah. Uh, Oh, there goes the Mosasaur. So, if you go up against an AI, one of these things, they do seem more powerful. Uh, some of you can probably tell me down in the comments below what that feature they've actually added in. I didn't really read much up on the dossier and on the forums about it, so I don't really know much about it. Uh, I'm not going to bother reading anything up about it on this video. But by the looks of it, it your dino does bleed out. If that's the right word to use or lose health over time after being attacked once and this thing just won't leave me alone all right guys that's pretty much it for this video so i just want to thank you all for watching and before i go i just want to thank you all for all the support and things on all the other videos all the likes comments and shares i really really do appreciate it if you're new to the channel and you want to see some more Look at him, he's like a little dog just looking at me. If you're new to the channel and you want to see um, more of this type of stuff, uh, don't forget to subscribe. And if this video enjoy if you enjoyed this video and it helped you in any way, shape or form, don't forget to leave a like. And I'll see you in the next video.